Who, who is the Muslim he like to join us and debunk us? Oh, we have a new, uh, a new war. This guy is a big shake, you know, in, in the Muslim world. Hey, he will just show you. Uh, we have Nasser too. How are you there, Nasser? Hello. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Hello, Imam. Good. I debunked Christianity yesterday. You want to debunk Christianity? I just finished. You just did? Yeah, I finished, bro. I made six people enter Islam, bro. What do you mean? I know, it's very hot. How they enter Islam? Uh, through my light. Through what? Through my light. Through your light? Yes. You are light too? Yes. So Allah is light, Muhammad is light, you are light. So who's God in Islam? Yeah. Everyone, everyone with a good passage is a light. Can you show me that from the Quran? Open your brain. How oh, you want to open my brain? Yes. Do you have you a, don't need to do be you, do you to have a brain? No, you just called yourself God because the Quran says Allah is the light of the world. And you said you are light. So you claim to be Allah. Yeah. Islam is light. Islam is right. You are changing topic. I want light, you. light. Islam is light. Islam is light. Are you Islam? No, I gave them the light. From where? Uh, from Al Qadr, Allah's Qadr. From what? Allah's Qadr. Qadr mean uh, dest Allah. destiny. But you said I am light, guys. Did he say his light when he joined in the stage? Did he say I am light? You said you are light. Now you are changing your statement. Okay. What I do you mean? Okay. I want to go with a second one. I go. I want to go with the second one. Oh, so the light. first, okay, the first one, you got a spank. Do you agree? Yeah, I got it wrong, Gary. Yani. Oh, okay. He got spanked for the first one. Okay, go for no, I'm, I'm the I'm the generator. Okay, you are the generator. Okay, go for the second one. Yeah, I told you I'm gonna go with the second one. Are you Islam's Are you light. both cousins? I'm because you light. sound so smart, both of you. Are you cousins from the same family? No, that guy is Hindi. Yeah. I got nothing to do with him. He's what? Hindi. He's a Hindi. Oh, he's making fun of you. You are an Indian. He's an Arab. See, they look down at you. What do you mean Hindi? Why are you, why, why, why are you are laughing at him? Why are you being not. rude? What? Yeah, you are. He's being rude. I'm not being I'm being rude. rude? Because in Islam, we believe if you, if you pretend to be another than being your culture, you're a kafir. Ah, if you pretend... Okay, did your prophet yeah, he, did your prophet pretend to be? Pretend to be to what? He used to call himself with his dad's name. With his dad's, he used to call himself Qurashi. He used he to call, call himself, himself by Qurashi. his dad's name? No, no. Like what? his dad's uh, name, yeah, like Muhammad, uh -huh. Abdullah. Okay. The, I don't know his full name, but Muhammad Abdullah. And I don't the know. sons of Kilab, do you know what Kilab mean? Kilab doesn't mean Kilab. Kilab doesn't mean Kilab? What do you mean? Kilab means dogs. Yeah, I want to ask you, Christian Prince. Is that Don't change topic. Don't the... change topic. Yeah. Your prophet last name is dogs. Explain to us why. No, Kilab doesn't mean dogs. Kilab to mean dogs. I can show it to you from I the... know, but it doesn't mean in his name Kilab, Yanni. Ah, huh? Kilab only make dogs. Okay, give me the other name. Yanni... What, what, Yanni, what, shaitan, what, what Yanni? What Yanni? What Yanni? What Yanni? Give me, give me. It says his last name is Dogs. Dogs mean dogs. I can show. Here we go. I can go right now. I know. I know. I know. Kilab mean dogs, but then. Okay. So Muhammad, means... Muhammad ibn well, Abdullah ibn Qusay ibn Kilab. So his last name is Kilab. Why? His yeah. family are a family of dogs. The name. What? And everyone in your family is Kilab. Yeah. His last name. His last name is Dogs. Do you see it? Read it. Read it. Here we go. Kilab, Kilab, Kilab. Do you see it? I Kilab. know. I know. I know. But okay. So your okay. prophet last name is Kilab. Explain to us why his last name is Dogs. Not only dog. Dogs. He have many fathers. Nobody knows 
who was doing doom boom boom with this yeah, uh, علم, you're not funny والله you're not funny يعني his name is الكلب what do you want why they call him dogs <laughs> oh you debunked Islam astaghfirullah what he debunk you debunk Islam يعني well, I know you, you said to me because he is a man he called him by his father in fact the Quran never mentioned who is Muhammad who is Muhammad in the Quran can you tell me where in the Quran says who is Muhammad his name is Muhammad or Ahmad no he has two names Ahmad and Muhammad uh, like, like, like Paul no way what he what? has 99 names he have 99 names right Okay. And one of them are as, Muhammad. As long as 99 names, where in the Quran it says Muhammad have 99 names? I got you. Go ahead. It doesn't need to say inside. There is inside the hadith. Ah, yeah, so you fabricate Quran. those names to make him equal to Allah. Ya Allah. There's things in the Quran that there is things in the hadith that are not in the Quran. The same as the names of Allah, they are not in the Quran. Few only. Okay. Okay. Only 70% of the names of Allah, maybe less, are in the Quran. The rest is a fabrication of the Muslims. Right? No, no. No, no nobody knows? It was listed. It was, it was all compiled in one name. It was like taken from every place. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, you know, listen. Uh, the first one, you said you are wrong. So give me the second one. No, what? Uh, what is the okay, second wait. one? Okay, wait. First impromptu, yani. I'm, I'm not, you're not going to debate me because I have no knowledge. I have to read the tafsir and that's going to take You you uh, told me you told me time. you are going to take time for me to read the tafsir. Well, guys, he told me he is here to debunk me and he made six Christians enter into Islam. Yes. Yeah. And Yo, now you are saying to me know. and now you are saying to me you don't know nothing about no. anything you need the time to read the tafsir. Look, I I need time to read the tafsir. Which tafsir you might read? Uh, I have to. I take some. I take some from some, some from some. You will touch some from some, some. Seriously. Yeah. Show me. Show me. Show me the. No, how how many? How many now. some you want? To, what some from some, some? What do you mean? You made me dizzy. That's a lot of some. I take some from. I take from Ibn Baz, mostly. You take from Ibn Baz. Yeah, mostly. This guy who have a tattoo in his penis? Why you opened it? Just like you asked the girl for her boobs? Okay, yeah, show me. Okay, I will. I will go with you. The one who knows about the private part, that means he opened it. So how you Muslims all knows about the vagina of Aisha and what is written in the name of every Muslim woman? Did you see it? Your prophet said. Show me the hadith. Your prophet said. Every woman is written on her vagina the names of the men who will F her. Is that true? Yeah. Tell me the hadith. No, but is it true or not? I don't know. Okay. But remember you said, no. you asked me, did you see it? Right? So your prophet must see that, right? Yalla, show me, please. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, we have to, we have to put a panty on, on the hadith. It's very dirty, so we have we can just show it like this, you know. We have to, all right. Uh, let us see here. All right. Do you see my screen? Yeah, I see Mufti Mink. I forget about Mink. He is right. He's retired since he ran away from me. It says here. Uh, what? What? What kind of hadith is that? Maktub on ala kull farj. اسم ناكحه on each private part is written the name of it is ifar correct does it mean does it does it mean actually actually that the name is written in her vagina yes yes and this is the book it's called the akuna ma'asadiqin by dr muhammad tijani Page number 135, and you speak Arabic anyway. Okay. You do not need translation. Uh, is, that, uh, is that Shia or Sunni? Oh, Tijan, okay. No, this is not uh, Shia. Okay, okay. I can show it to you from anywhere. I mean, this is just library. Uh, 
But do you want me to? The one who say that, the one, the one who say that is the Sunni. The one who say that is the Sunni. True or false? Show me what kind of hadith it Okay, hold on. Okay, you know what? I decide to show you a video. Is that okay? Okay. All right. And they bring a better argument. Bring okay. Rida al Kabir. Okay, okay. No, this is better. Researching in the name of every Muslim woman, the name of the one who will live her. So if a woman, she is a whore, she will have a yellow pages there. You know? Let us see. Your prophet is mentally ill. Do you have any proof that it's written really in the name of the vagina, the name of the men, men they will F the women? Here we go. You see, here we go. This is this is your Islamic website. Let me let me show you. This is this is your Islamic Sheikh. Official Islamic TV. I'm not listening to nothing. What do you mean not listening? Wait. She I just she just said. So you are saying it's written in the the name of and on every vagina the name of the men will f her. He said sure. She said even if it's not legal, which means. So do you agree with the sheikh? I just showed you your sheikh. You still I'm not deny? listening. I'm not listening. What do you mean not listening? Why are you not listening? No, I don't know. You don't know? I can't. I can't. I can't. Wait. What do you mean you cannot? I will post the link for you. Here we go. Open it in your side. It's in Arabic. You speak Arabic. And be honest. Does the, does your sheikh and your Islamic TV says it is written in the on the vagina of every Muslim woman the name of all the men will have her? Yeah. It says that, right? I don't know. What is he? Is he Ash'ari or... Uh, I don't know about that uh, word. But what... Uh, where did he get that from, Yani? From the, the from the vagina, he looked at his wife's vagina, he look, he saw all the names. You tell me. You are asking a Christian no. you are asking a Christian person to tell you where he got this from. What's wrong with you? You Muslims are really No, I'm weird. asking where did the Sheikh get that from? I, this is this is a Muslim There's Sunni. No way he's you see, open first his, I, I his showed you I showed you reference, you said this is Shia. I know I'm showing you this is a Muslim Sunni. You know how they dress. This is a Muslim. This is Islamic TV no, from no, Egypt. No, no, no. You're going to show me a random video and then telling you, uh, telling me that's the proof of that hadith. Show me a hadith. I'm not going to look are, at one man are you saying, wearing black clothes. Are you saying this guy oh. is lying? Uh, of, uh, I don't know. Okay, just say it. He's, he's lying. He's lying if he doesn't show a sahih hadith about it. He's lying if he's not showing had a sahih. Sahih, yeah. Uh, why, I don't you, know, why, I didn't why, why, you, why you think he is lying? Why you think he is doing that? Is he the musbah? Is he the musbah? Is he? A is, he uh, is he like who is he to take from him? Oh, uh, okay. He is a big sheikh. Who are you? You are nobody. Well, who is that here? It's the first time to see him. Yeah. You are nobody. This guy is a big sheikh. He is the biggest yeah, sheikh yeah. In, in the sheikhi religion, Islam. You know? So what do you No mean? one knows him. No. What? Nobody knows him? No one knows him. Is he a alum? No, he's not. Come on. What? That's it? You solved the problem? Yes. Yeah. I solved it. Okay. Let me ask you. Is it true that you must believe in destiny and everything is written? Yeah, but, Qadr, yeah. All right, written where? Uh, uh, in Samawat. No. Where, where is it written? So wait, wait, wait. Isn't it the angel, he go inside the mother of your Muslim woman, inside her vagina, and he write her destiny there? Yes or no? I don't know. Wait. What do you mean, though? What? Shame on you. I don't know. You are, uh, you know, not being honest now. Okay, let's go. Let us go to the uh, to the hadith. And now, don't tell me this is daif and this is. Uh, here we go. 
When the women no, she is, he, no, no, it says that he writes it in a loch al mahfuz. No, no, no. Listen, it's in the vagina. Read with me carefully. It's in, it's in the sky, yeah, and it's all in right, the sky. All right, okay. I was, I so was now, okay, so now the oh. sperm, the sperm enter inside the women, correct? Do you see my screen? No, it's the opposite. Yeah, I'm saying. All right. So now it's a sperm, and the sperm go inside the screen, inside inside the the, the women. And then Allah, uh -huh. He send an angel and He write inside the women. Is that correct? And this angel, okay. He is inside the womb. Is that correct? Uh -huh. All right. Where He write the destiny? You said to me in the tablet, but He is inside the women. Where He write? Uh, let me speak in Arabic. Let me speak in Arabic. What Arabic? You don't know Arabic. I know Arabic. Okay. Say a. Alif. Ah, see, you do not know Arabic. Read then. I said Alif. In Allah Azza wa Jal, wa kulli rahm malik fi qul na Rabb min atfa min ayi Rabb alqa Rabb maqa. In Arad Allah yqzi hal qalqa. قال الملك أي رب ذكر أو أنثى شقي أو سعيد فما رزق إلا أجل فيكتب ذلك في بطن أمه. Ah. Yeah, it is in the. Ah. Yeah, I read it. What do you mean you read it? Your God, He have an angel uh, inside, he he inside, that he write inside the he women, that he write inside the women. Okay, in order for the angel to go inside the womb, he have to go where? So he, it says that Allah writes whether he's a male or a female. You are not answering. You are not answering. In order for the angel, I don't know. You're telling me how does the angel enter from inside? Yes, from he where? From where he enter? It's, it is the womb. Where is the womb? Where does it say? Wounds? So the angel of Allah, he entered from her vagina. Do we agree? No, it doesn't. And you're gonna tell me that he. Uh, it doesn't say inside. It doesn't say inside. So he is inside the vagina. Right, but he's inside. Even if it's inside, he's and you're in, gonna tell me that inside, the angel has to enter from the vagina. Let's say from the from the mouth. Let's say from the. Us. You're gonna tell me from the vagina itself. So, so the angel he go. Okay, so the angel he go in her mouth. She swallow him, but that will make him go to the anus. Yeah, not, maybe. Not to the womb. And uh, okay, how does the Holy Spirit enter through your vagina, uh, Christian friends? No, in the in, 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 well, we don't believe this is your Quran saying. The Quran says Allah. No, you, you believe the. No, 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 no. You see, you see, your Quran says Allah He breathed into Mary vagina. Is that correct? Yeah, we believe that. Yeah. Okay. We'll so, so why you so why you are rejecting? I just said to you, if Allah Himself He breathed in the vagina, that means your God is a vagina kisser. He put no, his mouth. Shay, he, he he put his he mouth. He, he, uh, shay, yeah, Christian Brunson, he didn't blow him. He did, he did blow, but then Jibril, he's the one blowing inside Mary's uh, can vagina. You, can you show me? Allah directly. No. This is not what the Quran is saying. You Muslims are you, you, you Muslims no. are lying. You Muslims are lying. No tafsir. The tafsir. You, the tafsir you says that. Ah, no. so you so you don't tafsir. follow you don't follow the Quran. You follow tafsir, correct? So admit yeah, now. The tafsir was ad, from ad, 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 Admit that the Quran never say that. Admit. No, the salaf. We took we took that from the salaf, and the salaf were the companions of. But the prophet and did your prophet did your did your prophet say that? It says, "Wama uh, yana mutawir Allah wa rasul." Did your prophet say? Did your prophet say the one who breathed into Mary is an angel, the one who breathed into her vagina? Yes or no? As I told you, there is a tafsir about it, and then I don't. No. I so don't tafsir, know, but tafsir, there's a hadith about it. Tafsir, there's a hadith about it. Tafs okay, show me. Okay, show me. Show me the hadith. Go ahead. Uh, while I'm while I'm looking for it, it's gonna take time. So talk to your why audience. You why you're looking? Why, why is it going to take time? Oh, like two minutes. Wait, one minute. Uh -huh. yeah, wait. All right. Yeah, as I told you, I'm not a alim, but I know most of my deen here. Yeah. Yeah, but the Quran in front of me. If you show me something that's not align with the Quran, that means the Quran is wrong. But the, but the Mufassirin say it was from Well, if the, if the Mufassirin says it's not Allah who breathed, and the Quran says we breathe into her, you know, into her vagina, 
and the translation is right is wrong because it says in her vagina and you speak Arabic and one it says chapter 38 verse number 72 Mary who guarded her vagina you know this is not the one hold on Osmar wait uh, we have Miriam chapter 66 Quran. chapter 66 and Mary the daughter if of Amor, who guarded her vagina not her chastity and we breathe into it not her body as the translation is saying correct but if I showed you the if I showed you فنفخ, are you going to enter slow فنفخنبي, 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 where Allah he breathed does it say we we breathe did Allah say we is that the angel talking Hello. who does it say about the farj. Yes, I know. Right? Okay. Who is so it says we breathe into her vagina. Do we agree? Yeah, it says All right. yeah, so, so do you agree that it says in the Quran she guarded her vagina, so we breathe into it from our respect, which means Allah he breathed into Mary vagina. Does it say that? I told you the Mufassirin is set up. I don't care. I'm talking about the Quran. Respect the Quran. The Quran okay. says, the Quran says, not, not Salaf. Who, are you, you follow Allah or you follow Abdul? Okay, if, you respect, if you respect the Quran, it says in the Quran. Do you agree with, with my translation for the Arabic? Do you agree? I, I agree with the translation of the Quran, but it has the. No, my translation. Yeah. I said she guarded her vagina, so we breathe into it. From our spirit into her vagina. Do you agree? I agree, yeah. Okay, guys, did you hear it? So the Quran says she guarded her vagina, so we breathe into mm. her vagina. So what the translation is saying, uh, breathe into her body, our spirit. Where? Where? What body? You just agreed. So, so you, there is an explanation. So you, must, ah, so you are not translating, you are giving false statement of the Quran. While the Quran saying Allah he breathed into her vagina in Arabic, you make it her body corrupting your book. And then you go to the interpretation corrupting what the Quran is saying for the Quran saying it clearly. That Mary, the one who guarded her vagina, we breathe into it. Okay. So you say to me, I accept the tafsir, I don't accept the Quran. <laughs> Oh yeah, it says in the hadith in in the in the Rasul of Rabbi Kalahab, like a gholam and zakiyan, in the in the Nafa Jibreel. Okay, hold on. And it if, the, so that it means in, hold on. Okay, it says in Surah Maryam. All right. So if if the one who breathed, you said to me this is hadith, right? Can you give me the hadith? Yeah, wait, wait, wait. Do you know? Go to the verse when it says. Wa, wa, don't, 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 uh, don't. You, you are lying. You said. Yeah, I will, I will explain it. I will explain it. You, 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 you said no. You said to me this is a hadith. Give me the hadith. Wait. No, no. The hadith is explaining one eye. No, 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 no. You said it's hadith. Give me I the know. hadith. Give me the hadith. Oh, no, it's, it's a tafsir. Tafsir, yeah. Ah, go to the eye. So you lie. You say, the, so tafsir. tafsir go to the eye of the Quran. I thought it was. Like, hold, on, it was. hold on, hold on, hold on. So now. So, 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 so the Quran says Allah. You're asking me. You're asking me to explain it for you. Go to Surah Maryam. No, no, I'm not asking. To, I'm, I'm not asking you to explain. You cannot explain it except what the Quran says. Go, go. I know. I will show you the proof that Jibril is the one. Okay, in the front of everybody. In front. In the front of everybody. Do you accept? Yes. The, do you accept the tafsir? Yeah, I accept the tafsir. And just go to the. Okay. Hold on. Give me the name of the tafsir and tell me. I accept this no, tafsir. Go to the, okay, I will show you, but first thing, go to the No, 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 just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait. I want you to promise me that you will give me the name of the tafsir. And whatever the tafsir says about any verse in the Quran, you will accept. Give me the name. Okay. Let's go to Ibn Kathir. Guys, I must so, for Ibn so do you accept Ibn Kathir? Do you promise yeah. that you will not back yes, down? I, huh? Yes, I promise. All right. Let us see what Ibn Kathir he says. This is the official government website of what? Saudi Arabia. Do we agree? Yeah, the kuffar. All right. What kuffar? Saudi Arabia is kuffar now? Anyway, all Muslims are kuffar anyway. The royal family. Read, read, read with me what Ibn Kathir says about your Quran. 
Can you read? I will highlight. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will highlight for you. You know, I will highlight for you. قال لي ابن شهاب صورة الحزاء أو كلي تعد قلت ثلاثة وسبعين آية فقال قط قد رأيت أنها تعادل صورة البقرة. Translate. You have the translation. No, you read it. You are the one who know Arabic. Come on. It's known, but I can't translate from Arabic to English. It's very hard for me. So do you agree, Ibn Kathir? He said that in one verse, one chapter in the Quran. There's 213 verses are missing. Yes. You agree? Guys, did he say yes? I said yes, yeah. So the Quran is correct. Because we have, we have, we have, no, no, we have hadith saying, no, the so difference the, between. So the Quran, Quran the, so the Quran. Wait, wait, so, wait. you're so, not going to let me complete. What you said? I yes. want to answer you. You said yes. I want to answer you. You said yes. You said. You said I'll tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let me answer. So now you said it's changed by Allah. Allah took two hundred thirteen verses from the chapter of Al Ahzab. Show me the reference. Yeah, but it's been exchanged with Allah. Either no, uh, either you admit that you are lying and the Quran is badly fabricated. Two hundred thirteen verses are gone in one chapter only. And this is Ibn Kathir. And you promised me that you accept Ibn Kathir, whatever he said. Now show me. Yes, I got you. Can show I me from, you can show me from Ibn Kathir you want. Where it says Allah told you to take 213 verses from the Quran. Go ahead. From this uh, chapter alone. What? What's your question? You said those are gone because Allah told you to take them off. Yes. Show us. No, I didn't say that. I said that Allah, He changed it with other verses. If He changed it with other verses, this is, uh, uh, guys, did you hear this? If Allah sent the Quran already, so if He sent you more verses, that will make the Quran more, not less. No, it says He exchanged the missing ones. Where it says exchange? Where? There's a hadith about it. <laughs> of course you know it. Of course you know it. Okay. If Allah exchanged, can you show me where it says that Allah exchanged 213 verses from al Ahzab alone? Not only exchanged, he took it off. Here it doesn't say exchange. He says, it's gone, it's gone. He said to him, how many verses it used to be in the chapter of al Ahzab? How many you have it now? He said, 73. He said, it used to be equivalent equivalent to the chapter of Al-Baqarah. Do you know what happened now? Hundreds of verses are gone. And now, as long as you accept Ibn Kathir, who in the world can I believe? He is showing him that this is a corruption. He's asked, he did not say to him, oh, okay, Allah, he told, no. They are saying, well, they are gone. They are gone. Yeah, he's deep. This is Ibn Kathir, and he is saying this is a good isnad, as you see. There's no problem with it, all right? And then it says here, uh, as long we agree that there is 73 verses in the Ahzab, and there is 213 verses are missing, then the Muslims, they have to show us how they explain that by evidence, not by saying Allah replace it and this garbage. Show us 213 verses in one chapter alone. What is left? And why Allah want to do that? He found that he's wrong. So he decided to delete 213 verses. This is making one of, one of, wait, wait. One of, you know, the one thing, uh, the eye of Rajam bil Hijar, the stoning. It was one of the, it was one of the verses. Yeah, why? And sort of There's a hadith saying why, that it's in exchange. Why it is? There's a hadith says it's exchange. Yeah, you know, in sort of hadith, there was an ayah talking about a rajim bil hijar. Do you know about it? Uh, yeah, but it's not there. Yeah, that was a verse from the uh, hadith, يعني. And Allah exchanged this all with this. This is يعني. not. This is not true. This is not true. You are lying. Wallahi, it's true. What if I show everybody? I'm not insulting you that you are a potato, a big fat liar. Well, it's not me, the potato. It's the one asking the girl for poops. Okay. You know? You're 37 years old, more. Uh, hold on. So now you are saying to me that Allah, he did that. 
But isn't it Umar, he says, I am afraid that the people will not find the verses of a regime in the Quran? Did he say that? Yes, because it's one of the mafqoods. Guys, did he say mafqood? What mafqood mean? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, don't, don't, you yeah. made don't, a poo -poo. Don't. No, translate. translate, translate what mafqood mean. Say it, come on, be a man. Uh, mafqood means it's uh, lost. Yeah, lost. Thank you. Why you are lying saying to me this verse, Dino, you know, it I was there, uh, and Allah, he changed it. You're going with my You mind, said, uh, you just said it is lost. So it is not replaced by... It's not replaced by Allah. Apologize for lying. Yeah, it's lost and then it was exchanged. No, you said it's lost. Everybody heard you. Yeah, it was lost and then exchanged. What? Exchange with what? Exchange with the lost one. What lost one? <laughs> yeah, it was, it, yeah, it, it, uh, yeah, hold on, he, hold on. If the ones... He, he, it's lost. So it's, it's ex lost. Exchange... Not guys, listen, listen carefully. Exchange with the lost one. How you can exchange something with something already lost, which means it's not there? Huh? Wait. Sure, I'm problem. I'm sure all Muslims go crazy when they talk to me. Guys, he it's said, he said, I swear by Allah, you are a problem. <laughs> Are you wait, let's say that you, you're writing a book and you lost this is, one this sentence. This is, this is a hadith. Well, this is God. What, what, what one? I just showed you 213 verses in one chapter. Okay. Now, you Muslims, not only you are bringing other scriptures, you are taking scriptures. Look look what happened here. This is all Khattab. He said, uh, 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 Khattab said, addressing, saying, Allah sent Muhammad with the truth and sent down the book. And the verse stoning was included in what he sent down to him. We read it mm. and memorize it. The Messenger of Allah had people stoned to death, and we had done it with uh, 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 done it, which means the practice, also since his death, which means now they are talking about after he died. I am afraid, but people that people might say with this passage of time we don't find the verse of stoning in the book of allah and thus they astray by abandoning the duty which allah had received do you see it so yeah. taking the verse out of the quran is not wise because people still need to follow it it is not right Allah doesn't never approve it. The caliphate is afraid that it is gone. And he is saying why. By time, people will say, well, it's not in the Quran. So who took it off? And why? It, if was, you lost. it was lost. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. The Quran is lost. And you Muslims are lost. Because if you don't have Quran... Do you know, do you know the hadith about... Uh... A digin that ate one of the verses of the Quran. About what? Say again. A digin, a digin, a digin when Aisha was sleeping and one of the cows uh -huh. ate the verses of the Quran and then Allah said that he's going to replace it. Allah, he said, when replace it, give me the hadith. Wait. What I know that your prophet, when he died, a goat entered inside and she ate the Quran. Is that correct? Mm. You said Allah will replace it. Show me. This is the goat. I know her name. I know where she lives. I know her phone number. And remember, guys, he is the one who's mentioning this, not me. He's the one quoting this. He said the goat ate the Quran. Yeah. The Quran is the book of Allah, protected by Allah, and then the goat eating the Quran. Uh, are you sure you are not paid by a Christian prince? Yeah, I'm paid for me. What do you mean? No, because people they might do accuse you, you accuse you that I paid you money. Say Shahada. Tuk. Say hey, Shahada. Give me the money. Give me give me give me the money after the You will leave Islam if I give you money? No, give me the money because you told me you're gonna give me money. No, I said 
people would think that I gave you money. So no, no, no. Uh, Christian Brands. Christian Brands? Didn't we agree about giving me money after the... We talked before, yeah, Christian Brands. Uh, you talked to me before, Christian Brands? Really? Yeah, you told me you can have to give me money if I pretend to be a Muslim. No, I know, uh, I know about that. You are, okay, okay swear, swear, swear by Allah and His Prophet Muhammad that I did. We started to play. Swear, <laughs> swear on the Quran and Allah and Muhammad that I asked you to pretend I will pay you money. Go ahead. We started to play games. Yeah. See, now apologize for being a fraud. You're not going to give me money. Huh? Apologize for being a fraud. You're not going to give me <laughs> Apologize. You lied about giving me money. Abdul, you are in the corner. You are in the corner. So, guys, he said, I told him, if you pretend to be a Muslim, he, I, I will give him money. So, you are now, you are saying you pretended to be a Muslim, correct? Say yes. Say yes. Be a man, say yes. You are a coward. You're not a man. You're a coward. Say yes. Okay, say yes. You're a coward. Didn't you just say it, that I ask you to clean, pretend to be a Muslim? Say yes. Do you are You're pretend, trying to tell me say, to swear say on now, Allah? Say now that you are pretending a Muslim to be a Muslim. No, you're trying to make you me swear on Allah? You, uh, what? I'm trying to do what? You're trying to make me swear on Allah? Oh, Allah. You, so you, you don't want to swear on Allah? No. No. Why? You are pretending to okay, be a Muslim. You are, you are pretending to be a Muslim anyway. What are you worried about? Yeah, I'm not going to go to the wrong path. <laughs> so you are pretending to be a Muslim, but you are afraid of Allah? Yeah, because you told me you're going to pay me. Stuff. Just get out of here, potato. All of you are a bunch of donkeys.